Hi, I'm Kit Sadergren. I'd like to tell you about a mod that I've developed for the 356 Porsche oil pressure warning system. Now, as you probably know, the green light on the dash, indicating low oil pressure, comes on when the oil pressure falls below 5 to 6 psi. That's the factory setting. However, the workshop manual lists 28 psi as the minimum oil pressure, warm oil, 2500 RPM. So what I've developed is an add-on to the existing factory system that causes the oil pressure light to blink when your pressure falls below 28 psi and remain steady when your oil pressure falls below 5 to 6 psi as before. So let's see how this works. Okay, as you can see I've removed the distributor cap to make it a little bit easier to see some of this stuff. Here's the uh, factory oil pressure switch. That's the one that closes below 5 or 6 psi. Provides a steady ground to the green light on the dash. When we're going to put a second pressure switch on, we're going to tap into the pressure system. We do that by looking at this fitting right here that goes to the oil filter. It's a banjo fitting. has this uh, banjo bolt. Remove the banjo bolt and add a longer one called a double banjo bolt enabling you to put a second banjo fitting right here and then you're able to attach this uh, second oil pressure switch. This one's adjustable 20 to 40 psi and so I've got it set for 28 psi. If you like at that time you can add an analog pressure gauge. Uh, it's not necessary unless you like gauges. So when this one closes, I don't want a steady ground, so I need to make it an intermittent ground by using a small motorcycle flasher relay. It's underneath the generator. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to see it here. It's right there. It's kind of hard to see. So coming off of there then, you have a intermittent ground, which we return then to the stock factory switch. So you get either a solid ground if the 5 psi switch is closed or you get a, a uh, intermittent ground causing a flashing light when this 28 psi switch is closed. So that's how it works. Let's warm up the engine and we'll take a look at it in action. The engine in this car is a uh, fresh overhauled B engine so it has the tall oil pump gears but even so you can't maintain 28 psi at slow idle with warm oil. So we're going to see a blinking light, uh, at least at slow idle here. So let's take a look here. Looks like we're at about 150 degrees on the oil temp. Of course, uh, green light's on because the engine's not running. Got no oil pressure. So let's fire it up. Take a look here. Okay. So what do we got? At about 800. We're below 28. So let's speed it up a little bit. Below 28 at 1,000. There's 11, come on, 12, okay we're out at 12, slow it back down, we're good at 12, 11, 10, yep, back on there, okay. So that's kind of the way that it is, if you're driving on a hot day, uh, come up to a stoplight, it's going to blink. It's really no different than your generator light blinking at slow idle, as long as those lights go out when you speed up, you're okay. For full information on this whole thing, then take a look at the current issue of the 356 Porsche Registry Magazine. So thanks for watching, and happy motoring.